What's good, everybody? You're watching Game Changer 2.0. My name is Jared, and we're back playing Fallout 4. As you can see, I got my baller ass uh, power armor here. I'm working with the uh, Minutemen. Now, the last couple of episodes, I've kind of been doing some random stuff. Uh, doing some random missions. I figured that I'll start... Start doing the. What's up, son? What's up, son? Hey, what's I up, son? Bro, brothers are looking for you. What's up, son? He doesn't want that. Uh, I figured I'd start doing a little bit of main. Uh, doing a little bit of the main story, and uh, we'll get that going. I love this guy. He's always trying to sell some brooms. All right. I'll take a look. Sure. Excellent. Do you have bullets? That's what I need. I need bullets. I'm going to take all of your bullets. If not all, most. Let's do... I don't want to spend all my money. Actually, I don't care about money because when you have the scrounger perk... I mean, just money is everywhere. It's crazy. So, I'm going to eat this guy at a house at home. I'm not going to take that many bullets because I don't even... I don't think I have that many weapons for 45, for 45, but just in case I run across one. I'm buying the bar, you guys. I'm buying the bar. Does he have any... There's always a bag of cement. And I always laugh. And then you need cement to build stuff in your settlements. Take bobby bins. So, I don't want to lie. I need to get buff out because I am addicted to buff out right now. Um, let's go ahead and check out. Wham. I got mad bullets right now. Which is good. Um, I probably should find a doctor too. Because I'm addicted to buff out. You listen to Nancy Reagan, he is bad. Uh, it's night, so everyone's asleep. Alright, you know what? That's cool. Let's go find. Uh, last time we stopped in the main mission. We were looking for Mr. Valentine, who we found, who turned out to be very different than what we thought he was going to be, i.e. a synth in a trench coat and a hat that talks like Humphrey Bogart. Kind of. And here's his, here's his place. So, we're going to go talk to him. We're going to further the plot. I hope you guys are having fun with this, man. I am having a ball playing this. It's been a couple Allie? weeks since it got released, and I am are having a great time. Let's talk to me. This individual's busy. Oh, God. It's really you. It's Mackin, man. Well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday, death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends. Back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. Oh, I can move around while I'm talking. Hey, happy to do it. Yeah? Go diving into scary pre-war ruins all the time then, do you? Here, I know an amount wasn't on the table when you went out to find him, but you deserve a reward. Plus a little something extra. You know... If you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. Oh, I gotta sit down. This means I have to get out of... I have to get out of uh, the power armor. I can't exit my armor here! Okay, there we go. So, I love the fact that 
He gave me an old trench coat and a hat. I'm supposed to give this up. One detective to another, Black Dynamite, told you honkies from the wasteland that he was out the game. If you're trying to find someone who's gone missing, the devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can. No matter how painful it might be. There was a man and a woman. They didn't say much. But I remember they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team. Professionals. The kind that know to keep their lips tight when they're on the job. <laughs> Not sure <laughs> what the backup <laughs> What else can you tell me? <laughs> oh, man. That was such a tense scene. <laughs> My wife was murdered. She was trying to keep them from taking Sean, and they... They just... It's okay. You don't need to say anything more. So, we're talking about a group of cold-hearted killers waited until something went wrong to resort to violence. Anything else you remember? We were in a vault when it happened. Vault 111. It, it was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. With a lot of obstacles to get through just to take His one eyes person. are creepy. Anything else you remember? We're looking for my son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid. I love the fact agenda. the dog is on the desk. There's a lot of groups while the he's talking. That take people, <laughs> raiders, super mutants, the gunners. <sighs> Of course, there's the Institute. I know about the Gunners. I know about the Raiders. I know about the Super Mutants. But let's see what he has to say about all of the Gunners. High-end mercenaries. No job too brutal. They're in the running as likely suspects. But they wouldn't be the ones pulling the strings. Wait. Super Mutants? What are they? Big, green, muscles on muscles. In other words, hard to miss. Muscles on muscles I on muscles. Safely rule them out. <laughs> <laughs> you think raiders might have done this? I honestly doubt it. They can barely organize themselves, let alone pull off something this complicated. So that leaves. So you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. If something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model sensors <laughs> there strip whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Oh my god, this is first of all, this is like every dog. There we go. <laughs> Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. And I'm a synth myself. A discarded prototype anyway. You're a prototype? As far as I know, never seen any other synth like myself. There's the older ones that are dumb as rocks and all metal, and there's the newer ones that are almost human. I'm somewhere in between. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? I honestly don't remember. Carry a gun. The man who killed my wife. He had a handgun. I didn't get a clear look at it. But that sound could have been a large caliber revolver. Huh. I'm starting to get a clearer picture of the kind of man our perp is. Anything more you can tell me? One of them came right up to me. Bald head. Scar across his left eye. Wait couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? I can't remember, honestly. I might have. 
Everything was foggy. Mm. Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a house here in town, right? And he had a kid, uh -oh. didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned wet stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. You said he lives here? He's still in town? They both vanished a while back, if I'm remembering right. But that house is still there. Let you and I take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. See if we can snoop out where he went. Security doesn't really go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. <laughs> he always is, which is why I had to fucking rescue him the last time. All right, let's get in this mug. Because he can't walk very fast without it. But the detective outfit is kind of a pretty boss, so might have to jump in that business. Oh, uh, there hasn't been four glitches, but that was probably the best. That was probably the best. Alright, let's do this thing. There's a part of town that security does not go in. I dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance. He's more than just a mercenary. Do, 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 Quick, do, clean. Do, so, do, 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 man, I am, this is hilarious. Odd, says he's our man. The idea we're having just a casual conversation with a dude in a walking tank, it's the funniest thing. Team to kidnap a baby and leaving one of the parents alive for later. <laughs> Not many mercs in the Commonwealth can pull that off. God, this God, this place is awesome. All right, I should keep going. It's getting weird in third person. So. Going in? We going in? We are. You going in? Keep an eye out, will you? See if I can get this open. Uh oh. Keep an eye out. Yeah, cause nothing suspicious here. Why don't nothing you give suspicious it a try? here. Oh god, here's my dog. Why don't you give it a try? Master lock. I can open master locks. Okay. I know this is thrilling video, you guys. But such is such is the life of Fallout 4. Sometimes you have terminal hacking, sometimes you've got lock picking. It's not all shit blowing up. There you go. Nice. It's not all shit blowing up and Let's take a look around. Mini nukes and so Got on and so forth. Investigate his house. Okay. I'm gonna investigate his house. As in steal everything. Wait. Place seems small to you. Uh, oh, I thought that was capstan. Okay. Let's see, what's the duct tape? Oh, it's like there's corn. And to check out that desk. Check out the desk. Oh, there it is. There it is. Ah. God, these things are creepy. Take dirty water. You can. It seems like you can make a lot, a lot with the the dirty water, which is cool. Because you know, um, what was this chair? Nick Valentine. I don't want to talk to Nick. Look out, uh, Nicola. Nicola, what's in here? I don't need a pistol. 
I got mad pistols, son. Purify water. Flammo. Purify water. Take that. Take the water! Nothing in the cabinet. Cigarettes. Use the oil can. Cigar. Oh, wait, stim packs. Stim packs. Oh, wait. Plastic cartridge. Cigars. Gwinnett Stout Beer. 44 caliber bullets. And cigars. San Francisco Sunlights. They're on its own. Use dog meat. Dog meat can pick up the scent. Say, that's not a bad idea. Some dogs out there in the Commonwealth can track a man for miles. That's right, now, boy. Dog now get off eager for the, the furniture. Dog. Why don't you let him have a whip? See if he picks up on the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. If you have to face Kellogg on your own, just say so. Words of wisdom. Kellogg really is the one who kidnapped your son, and he's dangerous. But the so mood lighting is great. It's really scary. Looking at this anything guy. Anything else the Commonwealth throws at you? Goodbye, Nick. Hopefully not forever. I want to see you and your kids safe and sound when you get back. Good luck. Anytime you need help, just come knocking. Everybody's my companion. But I always go with the dog. Okay, so there's nothing else in here. Let's see if we can't find some action! Dog meat. Get the scent, boy. Got something, boy? All right, let's do this. Good to be back in Diamond City. See you later, Nick. Oh my God, that graphic's hilarious. Wow. All right, so let's see if we can't find some action. Oh, it's gonna go to the mayor. Oh, it's gonna go to the mayor, isn't it? We're getting the fuck out of here, I guess. Oh my god. Goss rifle. I'm I'm never really good with those in other games, so maybe It'll be different in this. I don't know. Weaponry is very, it's amazingly varied in this. You know, the fact that I have to talk, I have such a, like that. normally I just have giant machine guns. You know, giant machine guns in, in, uh, in New Vegas, they had like the custom ammo, you know, the armor piercing bullets and stuff, but I think this is the first Fallout where I've had like almost almost every kind of weapon, or at least every kind of weapon that I've seen so far. Have you ever noticed when you're walking in power armor, it sounds like a marching band? Sunlights. San Francisco Sunlights. Kellogg's preferred brand, all right. Okay. Okay, boy. Let's track him. All right, let's get him. Let's get him. Oh, hi, bots. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
train tracks are never a good thing. Although I doubt that there's trains actually going. Uh oh. Step off, chump. Ah. In the face. God, they are keeping up with my dog. All right, we got him. We got him. Okay. Let's go. God, I really don't have. How do I have no? Oh, come on, I got no weapons. I got no, not no weapons. I got no. Uh, I have no shells for my shotgun. All right, here we go. Going down, 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 down. Search for clues. Well, I mean, there's a bunch of people who are dead. That helps. Bl investigate blood spatter. I wanted to investigate the blood spatter, but... What's up, the Lost the scent boy. Okay. Bloody bandages. Dog meat can track this. All right. Track it, boy. Hmm. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? Of course. You're the best dog ever. Ready go. Okay. We're gonna find this bastard. Uh oh. Uh oh. Well, mole rats. Oh no, they're dogs. Dogs are gonna attack me. <laughs> I was like, if we leave these things alone, we're not jumpy. But apparently, that's not. That's not it. Oh God! Where do those guys come from? I don't want to mess with those guys. Jesus! All right. I'll teach you to mess with me, jive chumps. All right. Just waiting for something to jump us. Just wait. Uh oh. Um, carcasses. Uh oh. Oh shit! I just want to point out that my dog is fighting a bear. Wounding. That's right, you're dead. It's meat. That's how I roll. Oh my god. Not a lot of ten. Not a lot of ten mil bullets around here, man. I'm just saying. Uh oh, I have a feeling he's gonna go in here. Down, down. Oh, this is a search for clues. Well, it'd be pretty easy because, huh? Chimes. Disarm. Whoa! Well, there's a pretty good fucking. There's a pretty good fucking clue. And Dogby just ran into a fucking mine, too. Yeah. 
Oh. Dirty ashtray. What is it, boy? What are we looking for? What? Where did he pick that up from? Gwyneth Stout. One of his creature comforts. Kellogg's still out there. We've got to track him, boy. What do you think, boy? I love the fact the dog just pulled the teddy bear out of nowhere to chew on. That sounds like dogs. I will say that Fallout has really captured to what dogs are really like in 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 this game. Or in, they find stuffed animals and chew them up somehow. They jump up on your furniture. They interrupt your conversations. Pretty much, you pretty much nailed dogs. Okay, there's this over here. This is really doesn't. Whoa! No, you're dead. You're dead. You have a fucking tin can. God damn it. Whoa! Now I need to pack of cigarettes. Fuck you. Come on, you're fucking dead. Let's shoot him. Took a toothbrush, I didn't mean to. Kneecap. Bottle cap, alright, finally, you got something like fucking mean. Right. Where's my dog? Oh, there he is. Dun, dun, dun. God, this is so amazing looking. Oh, God, there's a death call up there. Yeah, let's go ahead and quick save in case this goes badly. Hey, oh. Huh. Tracking known mercenary. Exercise extreme caution. Error. System corrupt. I can't feel my legs. <laughs> what happened? What happened? What happened here? Error. Operator deceased. Threat level Omega. He killed us. Who? Alright, well, there's a death call up there, so why don't we just end this episode right here in case things go badly. So, <sighs> you guys, we're gonna get into trouble because that death call is up there and we're in, we're gonna be in for it. So, oh shit, and he's coming this way! Um, <laughs> so, we'll talk to you next time. Remember... <laughs> Oh god, remember subscribe, like, and comment if you like what we're doing. Uh, check us out on Facebook, Game Changer 2.0, point spelled out because reasons. And we'll see you in the next video. Remember, don't talk about it. Do it!